Question 24. Describe the theory associated with the radius of an atom as it gains an electron and loses an electron. Gain of an electron leads to the formation of an anion. The size of an anion will be larger than that of the parent atom because the addition of one or more electrons would result in the increased repulsion among the electrons and the decrease in the effective nuclear charge. This, the ionic radius of fluoride ion is 136 picometer, whereas the ionic radius, whereas the atomic radius of fluorine is only 64 picometer. Loss of an electron from an atom results in the formation of a cation. A cation is smaller than its parent atom because it's it has uh, because it has former electrons because its former electrons while it's a cation is smaller than its parent atom because it loses one electron while its nuclear charge remains the same. For example, the atomic radius of sodium is 186 picometer and the atomic radius of sodium ion is 95 picometer. So, if you have a gain of electron, you can add an extra electron. So, what is the electron electron repulsion? It will increase the size of 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 the size gap increase हो जाए तो repulsion कर जाएगी तो आपका size increase करना ही पड़ेगा ना space बढ़ाने के लिए electron के बीच तो वो बड़ा हो जाता है पर जब आप loss of electron होता है तो क्या होता है आप electron को खो रहे हैं तो क्या होता है आपका नहीं एक electron तो घट गया पर आपका जो nuclear charge था वो तो same ही रहा उसमें तो कुछ भी नहीं घटा वो तो क्या है इस बार थोड़ा strongly attract कर पाएगा क्योंकि एक electron तो उसके लिए कम गया उसके लिए घट गया ना एक electron तो क्या होता है इस वजह से attraction थोड़ी सी ज़्यादा हो जाती है और cation का size अपने आप ही छोटा हो जाता है तो loss gain of electron formation of a ion increase in the size loss of electron formation of a cation and decrease in the size